there are some advanced things to know about working with layers in Illustrator as well. As you know, whenever you create a new object within a layer, all of those have a particular stacking order. If you want to see that stacking order, you can click on the little arrow just to the left of the uh, layers icon, and this will show you all of the groups and the paths that are within that particular layer. So if I wanted to know exactly what path is the body outline, I can click on it and you can see now it's been highlighted. Since it's in a group, I'll ungroup it. Let's try that again. I can select it and you can see by the little icon exactly where it's been uh, lit up. If I wanted to know which path is just this path, I can click on the little icon at the far right and that will light up that particular path and have it selected as well. If I close it out, you can see the other paths within the other layers as well. If you want to change the stacking order of each path or each layer, first of all, select the layer you want to affect. So let's say I wanted the red ladybug. If I was to select these now and place it on top of this bug, it's on top of it. If I was to click on the layer name and drag down, notice the hand icon appears, I'm going to drag it until there's a line between layer 2 and layer 1. That's where I want to place it. And now my red ladybug is below layer 2. If I accidentally click on it and drag it into layer 2, notice layer 2 is now highlighted, it will place that particular um, set of paths into layer 2. And so now there's only two layers. It's real easy to remove it. Simply open up layer 2, find the red ladybug, and click it and drag it until it's outside of or on top of layer 2. Now it's on its own layer back again. Another way of merging layers is by using the upper right hand corner of the uh, options for the layers. The very top right hand corner, click the little down arrow. This will give you a pop out menu. Notice from this pop out menu you can create new layers and sub layers. You can choose to flatten the artwork and so this will make all of the layers flatten down into one solid layer. This tends to come in handy sometimes. I'm going to undo that. Or if you select multiple layers by holding down the shift key, select the second layer, you can choose the layer options and choose merge selected. And both of those layers will be merged into the same layer by itself.